So I have kind of a thing to 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 connect with people that work here at Mind Pump. I'll serenade them while they're doing their job, and they love it and they appreciate it. No time is a good time for goodbye. What do you think? Thank you. So Doug's a great producer. He's an audio engineer. And so I just thought it was a natural fit for me to ask him to produce my next album. Like that, maybe? Or? I don't think that's your thing. And I just started laying down some tracks to see sort of if this was going to be a good fit, a little power couple dynamic. Uh, between Doug and myself. Okay, so uh, what's this one about? Justin on the guitar? Are you kidding me? The last vlog that we did did what? With BJ Penn, a big name like that, with a thousand views or something like that he got? Man, real soon here we're gonna have to open up one of those OnlyFans pages to uh, make up for all the money that we're blowing on these vlogs. You have a better idea than Justin playing the guitar? Are you serious? Maybe more melodic, you know, just like... Like a little higher, maybe? Or, um, I don't know about the falsetto thing. I'm yeah. not sure. Yeah, it's kind of... Yeah. It's not really... Sometimes I don't really speak the truth, okay? Sometimes I just out and out lie. I'll say, hey, Justin, you know, that sounds really, really good. He's playing this song and over and over again. I don't know. I feel like we're just, like, splitting hairs if we try to redo it over again. So, the, the truth is... I think you've done a really good job. I mean, it's about as good as it's going to get, in my opinion. And what I'm really saying is, let's just stop, okay? Whoa! Uh, hey! Doug! You know? You know what? I think we should that's take a break. Good. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's good. That's not a scary <laughs> I'm just trying to find the range. Like, I got the lyrics and everything already. Yeah, I just, you know. Good. Ooh, what? Right? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's good. I'm feeling good. it now. It's great. Yeah, something's, I don't know, something's been up with Doug. He's been really busy lately, but I know that can happen when you're um, like a poon hound, like he is. So it's, um, you know, ever since Mind Pump grew, he started to get a lot of attention from the ladies. A lot. Uh, especially the college girls. I don't know what they like. I mean, I think he's like, like that daddy thing. You know, he's a little older and, but young. He's also spry. So it's just, I mean, he's just, there's just poontang all over him all the time. So he's probably in the middle of it all. I don't know. Probably juggling a few few things. So, you know, we try to talk to him about it, but he gets caught up. He gets caught up a little bit. So I think right now he's just in the middle of it, the whole thing. So I hope he's wearing protection. I've been staying late here almost every night with Justin. We're doing take after take after take of his music. You know, he's always trying to get it right. And each take is almost exactly like the last take. I don't really see a whole lot of improvement. It's getting closer. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you can do some audio magic. Honestly, I don't know if it's going to go anywhere. I mean, I spend all day long trying to make the guy sound great on the podcast. Now he's trying to get me to do the same thing with this album, but you know, you're only as good as the material you have to work with. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if he's tone deaf um, or who told him that he's good at playing the guitar. You ever imagine like what it was like to watch Michelangelo sculpt David from a single piece of marble? Like that's probably what it was like. Like when he's playing that the guitar, you could tell that he gets lost in the, uh, I mean, the genius of the of just the music. I don't even think he's trying to play something. I think it just comes out of him. That's what I think. Uh, I mean, it's very obvious, right? As soon as he pulls that thing out, uh, Mozzie goes fucking berserk every time. I mean, he starts barking like crazy. And you know, Mozzie likes good music. 
So if we weren't in the house, I play music all the time. He loves good music. Uh, Adam's dog seems to really appreciate when I get on the guitar and I jam for a bit. He likes to contribute. Um, you know, there's some good energy in here a lot of times when I pick up the guitar and, and hack at it a bit. I just feel bad because he's got this amp in here. He's got, he just bought another really expensive guitar. And I don't care how expensive and nice a guitar is. You can't, you can't fix bad noise, dude. It's more interesting. It's entertaining. It's a much bigger industry. Yeah, yeah, people know us for fitness, but also we could totally be a band and rock. We already have all the makings of what you need for a successful band. Inside here, I mean, stickers, posters, blue shirts, red shirts, black shirts, yellow shirts, green shirts, white shirts. Well, we got hats. Okay, I got this back. <laughs> we got costumes, we got crazy stuff we can wear on stage. Like, are you not seeing the parallels here? Yeah, on our Mind Pump live tours, uh, you know, Justin really was itching to get out in front of the crowd because this is really an opportunity for him to live this rock star fantasy that he's always had. I remember he wanted to rent uh, some uh, rent a guitar and actually play like a song to open up uh, for the audience. <laughs> Good deal. So you guys ready to ask? Madam, uh, hey, I'm a scientific study. I was thinking more of the fans. People coming in, having an experience, having something entertaining, uh, something with some pizzazz. Sal and Adam, they really thought it was going to uh, maybe set the wrong tone for the, the event. It was so hard to tell him that this was a, a terrible fucking idea. Two against one, and uh, quite frankly, Sal and Adam, they won, okay? Oh, it, it totally uh, hurt his feelings when we told him no on the music. I, you know, And I'm sure when he watches this, it's gonna hurt his feelings. He definitely does it. But I also know that he appreciates the truth. It's fine, you can be honest. Like, I, I can take it. I, I have been honest, okay? Okay. The truth is, he's terrible. He's absolutely terrible. Um, he barely can play the guitar. Um, and he is not good at singing. You, you guys are just too much going on here with these vlogs, Justin playing the guitar. I, I got too much shit to do. I've got to get out of here. We got to find some way to monetize this business or we're going to sink. Yeah, Adam's got this weird jealousy uh, of Justin. Um, so he like, he doesn't want him to outshine him, which can happen very easily when Justin starts performing. Little by little, Adam's building confidence. I think in about five to 10 years, he should be ready for Justin to play music. Maybe we okay. should bring in some professionals. Like we should bring in. I mean, you're right. I, yeah. I'm not a professional producer. Get... So Justin talked about bringing in a, a pro producer for the album, which you know, in some circumstances, I may have taken offense. But in truth, I'm not a music producer, so I had to kind of put aside my ego. Yeah. 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 I'll, I'll make some calls. Yeah. Okay. We just have to do a little bit of a reality check here, uh, in that. <laughs> Pro producer or not, it's going to be what it's going to be. 